Hello, welcome to the Game on Grapevine, where we're getting political. Before the election, all three main parties pledged to introduce a video games tax relief so we can compete internationally on a level playing field. Why has the government reneged on that promise? Yeah, rene reneged. Why have you... what she said? Well, we had to make difficult decisions about tax relief. But the honourable members opposite groan. Groan, boo. But what? You know, can we think of one thing they're actually going to support in terms of getting the deficit down? Deficit. Answer the question. To, I can't think of a single thing. Video games. So we have got to take difficult decisions, and I'm afraid that tax uh, relief, which was not particularly Another successful or well targeted, has to go. Those are the difficult decisions we have to take. So video games have caused a storm in a Westminster teacup, but what are they all banging on about? Well, the incredibly articulate and incisive question came from Luciana Berger, the Labour Member of Parliament for Liverpool Wavetree. She's referring to a promise the Chancellor made, he's the guy skulking on the right mumbling stuff, to give tax relief to British video game developers so that our industry is on an equal footing with its competition abroad. What a brilliant idea to make a growing British industry even more successful, you might think. <laughs> No, they decided to scrap it. The Prime Minister's point being that times are tight, we're cutting back and you can't give money to everyone. Interestingly, the fact he didn't even mention video games in his answer or tackle Miss Berger's points head-on suggests that the gaming industry isn't highest on his priority list. Well, Mr Cameron, it should be. We here at Game On have a dream. A dream that one day British games developers will be judged not on the amount of tax they have to pay, but on the content of their games. We have a dream that one day British companies will receive equal financial subsidies to their overseas counterparts so that they may work hand in hand on the world stage. We have a dream today. More gaming government tomorrow.